Hey guys, it's Kayla, and today I'm filming a Valentine's Day makeup look, and this has a lot of nice pink, glowy undertones, kind of, so let's get into it. First, I'm using my Mario Badescu facial spray to just prime my face, and then I'm just tying my hair back to get everything out of my face. And now I'm applying my foundation. This is the Revlon Nearly Naked Foundation, and I'm using a stippling brush, but you could use any kind of brush, and I'm just blending this all over my face. Now I'm just taking my beauty blender to get rid of any of the streakiness that my stippling brush left. Next, I'm taking my Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer and I'm just putting this in little triangles under my eyes and on the bridge of my nose and on my cupid's bow and in between my eyebrows to just highlight yet conceal at the same time and then I'm just blending this all in. Now I'm taking my NARS Creamy Concealer and I'm just putting this on any blemishes or any red spots that kind of stick out and blending this in. This really helps cover them great. I love this concealer. Next, I'm taking a translucent powder and a big fluffy brush, and I'm just putting this on all the places I put my concealer on. So I'm putting it under my eyes, and on the bridge of my nose, and in between my eyebrows, and that whole area, the T-zone area, and then I'm putting it on my cupid's bow and my chin. And then I'm taking this powder kind of color, and this is like a color correcting powder. I'm just putting this under my eyes to further set my concealer and next I'm taking these two bronzing shades the contour from the Tartlet palette and I'm just mixing them together and contouring you could kind of see how I'm doing it but I'm going upwards on my cheekbones and into my temples Now I'm taking the blush from the Tardiest palette and I really love this blush. It's such a nice pink color and it really helps to add a lot of color to your face. I'm just putting this on the apples of my cheeks and blending this up. And then I'm taking the two highlighting colors and mixing them together and putting this right above where I put my blush and just blending this upward as well and this really helps to give a nice glow it really looks like you're glowing from within so i really love mixing these two together and i'm also putting a little of this on my nose and on my cupid's bow 
Moving on to the eyebrows, first I'm just brushing this out and this helps to really see all the spare spots that you need to fill in in your eyebrow. And then I'm just going to take the Anastasia dip brow and an angled brush and start to fill in the tail of my eyebrows and slowly make my way into the arch and then finally start to square them off on the inner part. Lastly, I'm just brushing them out again and this helps to blend it all together and then I'm taking a wax based product so an EOS lip balm works and just setting them. Now I'm going in with my Naked 2 palette and I'm just taking the lightest neutral shade and just using this as a base for all my eyeshadow. And then I'm going to take the blush shade from the Tartlet palette and since we are doing pink warm tones, I'm taking a big fluffy brush and just blending this all into my crease. This is a really nice pink color and totally works. It doesn't really matter that it's a blush because it is still a powder product. Taking the Naked 2 palette again, I'm taking a light pink shimmery color and a flat brush and I'm just packing this all onto my lid to give a lot of color and so you really see the pink shimmery glow. This is a really eye-catching pretty color and perfect for like a nice pink Valentine's Day look. And then I'm taking a darker kind of more mauve color and just putting this in like the outer part of my crease just to darken up the look a little bit and make it a little bit more smoky. Now I'm taking that same pink blush color we used before and I'm taking a little tiny brush and just putting this on my lower lash line to kind of even out the top and the bottom and make everything look complete and tied together. Now I'm taking the color Booty Call and this is a really shimmery pigmented color and I'm just putting this on the inner corners with a big fluffy brush. This doesn't really need to be exact or anything and I'm putting it under my eyebrow arch and then I'm taking a lip balm and just dabbing this on my lips before I put any lip products on. And this just gives a really good base for all your lip products. And then I'm taking the MAC lip liner in the color Boldly Bear. I love this lip liner. It basically works for any lip look you're going for because it's just a really neutral pink kind of color. And then I'm taking this bright pink from YSL. And this is really, really pigmented, but it's really nice. So I'm just dabbing this on lightly and it gives so much color already. You don't need a lot at all. And I'm just rubbing my lips together to kind of blend everything. And now I'm putting a red shimmery gloss on from Sephora. And this gives a really nice glossy finish to like the matte kind of lip. And that is all for your lip color. And I realized I forgot mascara. So now I'm going back in with the Lights Camera Lashes Mascara from Tarte. And I'm just putting this on my lower lashes because I do have eyelash extensions and I love them. I... I'm just finishing everything off with my Mario Badescu facial spray and that is the look. I hope you guys love it. It's really pink and glowy and perfect for like a Valentine's date night or whatever you're doing. Even if you're just hanging out with your friends. I love the colors. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to follow my social media down below. And I'll see you next week. Mwah! Take a breath.